And today I'm going to tell you how to change the size of the effects windows and Ripper and we start right now. What is going on? My name is Ben. Welcome to my channel. If you want to learn more about filmmaking, photography, acting and audio, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss anything. So one of the annoying problems in Ripper is that every time you open an effects panel or a plugin window on one of your tracks, the plugin itself loads at a very small resolution. If you have a bigger resolution on your monitor, I am using uh, UHD 4K. And in this case, as you can see, Easy Keys shows a very small. So if I try to maximize that, and if I click and drag the corner of that little, little window, nothing happens. And it's kind of annoying if you are trying to use your plugin because everything looks really small. So let me show you another effects window here. If I open a nectar, it's the same, same problem. If I uh, click and drag the corner, I cannot make it bigger. So let me show you the way to fix this. If you right click on your Ripper link, I have a link here on the side panel of my Windows 10. Uh, you can scroll down and right click on the Reaper link then you get a little pop-up menu and then you go down to properties and in here you have a compatibility tab so you click on it and last option the uh, second to last option is change high dpi settings so you click on that and now you get this little window and uh, this option is called high dpi scaling override so i want to click on that and then change this menu to system. Now, some people have better luck using system enhanced. In my case, system works just fine. So I'm gonna try that. Click on system and click OK. Apply, click OK again. Now I'm gonna double click on this testing file that I have over here that I've been using in this tutorial. And now you see, you will see that the effects windows open up at a normal size see so now we have a much better size to work with easy keys and even with nectar 3 if i click on the effects window now they have a nice size where we can actually see all the controllers that we have same thing though if you want to make it bigger even if you uh, click and drag the corner, nothing's going to happen. But again, now you have a much decent size to work with. Again, I'm working on UHD 4K, and this works really well for me. So now, if you want to, if this is not working for you, and if you want to bring it back to what it was before, I'm just going to close this, and you basically need to reverse your steps. So now I'm going to go and right click on the Reaper link, right click on the Reaper link within that little menu, click on properties, then we go and click on compatibility, click on change high DPI settings. And now you click on this little menu here and drop down menu and you change it to application the way it was before, and you need to uncheck this overwrite high DPI scaling behavior. So uncheck that, click OK, click Apply, click OK. And now if I run my testing file, and just let me show you that if I open my effects windows, then they are back to the normal tiny size, okay? Same thing with Nectar 3. So that's it. I hope this helps you fix this annoying problem with Reaper. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Until next time, see ya.